15 minutes boat ride from the Fisheries College waterfront facilities in KVN lies the beautiful Nago Island Mariculture and Research Facility. It is here where local scientists and international experts are spawning or increasing the growth rate of sandfish, a species of the sea cucumber. As it is difficult to determine the female species, the sandfish are taken collectively from the sea and bred in these tanks. It's only in time that the sea cucumbers start to increase. Depending on the different stages of its growth, the sea cucumbers are placed in the various tanks. These tanks are filled with seawater and together with the conducive temperature and the right type of food to feed, the population is said to grow exceptionally well. Among the local scientists and technical staff is Rowan, a scientist from James Cook University. He has been growing microorganisms basically food to feed the sea cucumber larvae in the tanks. The hatchery culture program so far is progressing well. It's an important process as it determines the growth rate and survival of the sea cucumber. These marine animals are used in fresh or dried form, a favorite delicacy in the world over, and as a result it has been overfished. As the ban imposed by the National Fisheries Authority on the harvesting of sea cucumber is still on, it's anticipated the research on Nago Island will ensure sufficient supply once the ban is lifted. Bridget Komatep, National MTV News.